Welcome to Premath. In this video tutorial, we are going to solve this given system of equations by substitution method. To get a complete understanding of this topic, please watch this video till the very end for additional practice problem. So let's get started. The very first thing we are going to do is we're going to call this the top equation as equation number one and this the bottom one equation number two. Two. And now in this, if you look at in this equation number two, we want to isolate x. So I'm going to say isolate x in equation number two. So let's put down equation two right now. 4x plus 5y equal to negative 10. I, we are going to move this 5y on the other side so we end up with 4x equal to negative 10 and then this 5y when we move on the other side become negative 5y and now since we want to isolate x we are going to divide by 4 on this side so that means we're going to divide by 4 across the board so that is 4 and 4 is gone so x turns out to be equal to simply that's going to be a negative 10 over uh, 4 is you can reduce it to negative 5 over 2 minus 5y over 4 and this is our x value in terms of y. We are going to call this equation number 3. And now in the next step, we are going to put this whatever we got x value in equation number 1. So I'm going to say put this whatever this x value in equation number one. So let's write down equation number one first, negative 4x minus 3y equals to 14. So wherever we see this x value, whatever this thing, we're going to replace it by this one. So that is going to become negative 4 times and our x value is simply negative 5 over 2 minus 5y over 4 and then minus 3y equal to 14. So the next step is we are going to distribute this one over here and this way this become negative 4 times negative 5 over 2 and then minus 4 times negative 5 y over 4 and then minus 3 y equal to 14. And let's simplify furthermore negative 4 times negative 5 over 2 negative and negative become positive 5 times 4 is 20 divided by 2 that is simply is going to give us positive 10 and here 4 and 4 is gone so we simply ended up with negative time negative is positive 5y and then we have a negative 3y equal to 14 and since we don't have enough space I am going to move right up here so as you can see we're going to combine these like terms so I'm going to say 10 plus 2y equals to 14 move this 10 on the other side so 2y equals to 14 minus 10 so 2y turns out to be equal to 4. We want to isolate y divided by 2. So that means y turns out to be equal to 2. Now 
this y equal to 2 value, I'm going to say put y equals to 2 value in our equation number 3. Our equation number 3 is simply x equal to negative 5 over 2 minus 5y over 4. So let's plug it in this y value. So x equal to negative 5 over 2 minus 5 times 2 divided by 4. So that is going to give us negative 5 over 2. And this one, if you reduce it, that is going to give you negative 5 over 2 as well. Since we have the same denominator, I can write it once, negative 5 and negative 5 x equal to this thing. So x turns out to be equal to negative 10 over 2. That means x value turns out to be negative 5. Thus our solution turns out to be x equal to negative 5 and y equal to 2. You can also write it a little bit differently. Negative 5 comma 2 in vertex form. And that is our answer. And here is your assignment. Can you do this problem on your own? You can take your time. You can pause the video. Luckily, I have already uploaded this video as well. Please go ahead and check it out and see the correct answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.